Hey all my shining stars and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. I'm back. Did you guys miss me? I hope so. I have been enjoying, enjoying, enjoying my holiday break, my time off from work, my family, my son, Christmas, Happy New Year to everyone, by the way. I contemplated on whether or not I wanted to make my first video back for 2023, a empties video. I'm so mad at myself because prior to this, I had told myself, I said, you know you're gonna be busy during the Christmas holiday break while you're off traveling, visiting family, spending time with my son. I originally told myself I was going to record this by like mid-December. Needless to say, that did not happen. So here I am <laughs> recording it now, filming this video now, and I have accumulated way more stuff than I wanted to because I did not want to make this video super long. I really did not. I'm sorry. But I do want to go ahead and get this stuff out of my way um, and recycle in the trash, wherever it needs to go. And so I was like, let me just go ahead and film this one first. But before I start on my empties, I do want to send a shout out to my sis, just Kayla Michelle. Um, I received my Christmas card and my gift and I just got it in the mail today. So um, I just wanted to mention it before I got started. Um, I'm not going to read everything that it says inside, but I will say that um, she did give me a Lush gift card. And so I'm super excited about that. And I look forward to taking me a trip. Or I can't even wait. I'll probably go this weekend, honestly. Like, I'll probably hit up Lush this weekend because I'm like a little kid with this gift card. And I'm just going to go see what I can find, Okay. So I don't even know where to begin, but let me just go ahead and get started. I'm going to try to get through this um, fairly quickly so that I do not make this long, but I'm going to go ahead and just jump right in, okay? So first up here, I have this Lysol toilet bowl cleaner. I purchased this from Sam's Club. If I have you, if you haven't watched my um, videos before, or and this is your first time, I mentioned plenty of times before when I shop in bulk, I shop at Sam's Club. Me and my mom have been members, have memberships at Sam's for quite some time, years, and so I don't shop at Costco, I don't shop at BJ's, but I do purchase this at Sam's, and so I have plenty of it. Would I repurchase? Absolutely. It gets my toilets very clean when I do clean them and clean the bathroom. And so I would repurchase. Here is a room spray crushed candy cane. And so we, yeah, we use this um, for mostly of December, most of December um, Christmas scent. I, I enjoyed it. Would I repurchase next Christmas season? Definitely. It was a good one. Um, this is a Game Power Blast dish spray. I wanted to try this one out. Prior to this one, I did have the Dawn. Um, and of course, you know, if you're familiar with these, you take the pump, the handles off and, you know, you reuse them. And then when you go back and purchase them, all you have to do is purchase the bottle and you just put your pump back in there. So of course I still have my pump, but I enjoyed this. I love it. I also love the Dawn. So it really, I, I don't have a favorite, but I do like both of them. So whichever one I picked up first would probably be the one that I would get at that time. Um, I have some empties, hair empties, I think only for my son this time. I told you guys he raves and raves about this. Um, hair care brand. This is As I Am for like natural hair, curly hair, all types of hair. Honestly, I want to start trying out the products in this brand a lot more because he loves them. This might be the only hair care brand that he uses, but this was the classic, I got hair on it, excuse me, classic double butter cream. And this includes cocoa butter, shea butter, castor oil, sugar beet oil, and Jehovah oil. So that's that. 
it's pretty much empty he used this on his hair and like i said he loves it um i'm in no particular order by the way so you'll just see randoms as i pull them up this was a three wick candle um i know i hauled this in one of my videos eucalyptus snowfall mm. so good so so good i am a eucalyptus fan so I think eucalyptus spearmint and the aromatherapy may not have been my favorite. It was too strong, but for the most part, I am a eucalyptus scent fan. Y'all know that's my Glade automatic sprayer, so <laughs> you're going to hear it, okay, in every video. <laughs> this is a Target candle. I have been wanting to try this. What is the brand? Threshold. I wanted to try this brand and I wanted to try this particular scent. This is the Berry Lemonade and Melon. Um, this smells awesome. Oh my God, it's still strong. Um, it did soot a little bit, as you can see. I don't remember it burning super hot, but obviously, I mean, you can see that there. It's burned all the way down. This is good. For the longest time, I was looking for this candle in Target. Every Target I went in, I was looking for this particular scent. Let me rephrase that. I could not find it. It wasn't, it was online, but it was out of stock, et cetera, et cetera. And I was just having a difficult time. Uh, right before Christmas, I think I had made a trip in Target and I ended up finding it. So of course I picked it up. Um, and I think I had a gift card at that time. It's only like six bucks and it's a really pretty decent size. It is 11 ounces, so it's a steal, and that scent is good. If I find it again, I am definitely repurchasing. I told you guys I go through these quite a bit. This is the Dove Sensitive Skin Bar. Love it. I use it on my face, downstairs, whatever. It's multi-purpose. Um, I buy those in bulk as well. This is another hair empty from my son. This is the As I Am brand again, and this is the classic leave-in conditioner. It's pretty empty. I'm going to start trying out their products. I think I have a few in my cart right now on Target, and I am I'm going to be trying them out soon. He loves it. And I'm like, what? I want to see what he raves about so much. This is a Lysol disinfectant spray. Y'all know I'm always going to make sure but y'all know c word is still around amongst other things and so when it comes to uh this and disinfectant wipes etc etc i am going to keep them on deck oh my gosh i wanted to tell you guys about these o m g can you see this yes these are the Oreo ice cream sandwiches. I am a Oreo fan. Oreo cookies. I don't care. Oreo flavored ice cream. So when I saw, I think they have like, they have these, the ice cream sandwiches, and they have the cones or something like that. I don't know, but these were awesome. Um, I think I purchased them or I found them in walmart so if you are a oreo lover fan such as myself i would suggest you try them out okay all my east coast people guys girls you know <laughs> or if you visit if you don't live on the east coast and you visited the east coast before um particularly specifically washington dc then you guys would know what I'm talking about when I talk about the um, mambo sauce, okay? Um, and I saved this bottle because, and I couldn't get the rest out, but I saved this bottle to show you guys, and some of you probably already use it. I don't know, but if you don't, I'm putting you on. If you are familiar with mambo sauce, you like it, you love it, you've had it, You've been to D.C., you've been to the East Coast. That's where the D.C. is like the original, original mambo sauce on your wings, your fries. If you know, you know. If not, I'm just saying. This is popular. It's good. 
this is the next best thing you can get if you don't get the original Mambo sauce itself. You can now purchase, it. I think I purchased mine in Target, but I think Walmart also sells it now too. Um, try it out. I mean, it's just as good, maybe, but it is decent, you know? So if you want the next best thing, try it out. This is from Capital City Mambo Sauce. This is the mild, they have a mild and they have a spicy or hot Washington DC style wing sauce good i would repurchase absolutely here are some stop it dryer sheets these are the snuggle i'm gonna be honest with y'all i'm a fan of snuggle can y'all see that yeah this was the exhilarations lavender and vanilla orchid this was so light i i, I don't I love Snuggle, and I know this says new. I'm not sure when I purchased these, but it's empty now. I could barely smell these. I don't think it's Snuggle, but it was this scent. It's a no. I wouldn't repurchase that scent. Um, Here is a OxyClean odor blasters. I went through quite a bit of laundry products this time. I use this in all my laundry. It smells good. I mean, it's OxyClean. This is an odor and stain remover for sweat, musty towels, and body odor. Look, I'm not saying, y'all, that our laundry is um, musty and it stink like that. But what I'm saying is, <laughs> if you want a little extra freshness and you want your clothes to be super clean and you want the stains to get out, purchase that. I had this in one of my other empties videos and I raved about it. I told you guys this was super good. This is the Frosted Sugar Cookie International Delight Creamer. I had to run it back one time, one more time, one more time. I can't really smell it now, but before I could smell it and I can taste it. This is super good. Sugar cookies, if you didn't know, are my favorite type of cookies anyway. So this was right up my alley, a little Christmas scent. It's probably not even in the stores no more. I don't know, but it was good. If I saw it again, I would repurchase. Um, This is, these are really good guys. This is the Grin brand. Um, I don't know if it's in Walmart, but I purchased, purchased this brand out of Target. These are the disposable tongue cleaners. If you're not cleaning your tongue during your oral hygiene routine, then I'm going to need you to speak to your dentist <laughs> when you go back for your next appointment. Now, I will say I have used the metal ones, plastic, whatever they are, metal, I want to say. But, and I, I I will be having a haul that's coming up soon where I found another one, um, I believe in TJ Maxx, and it actually has a case to it, which I love. And I think it was only like five bucks. So I was super happy about that. Um, the only thing I don't like about the metal ones is that depending on where you get it from or whatever, they may not have a case that goes along with it. So it's kind of inconvenient if you want to take it with you when you travel or something like that. I mean, it's just sticking out in the open. But like I said, the one I recently purchased, the metal one, it does have a case. But these are perfect for travel. I mean, they're super small. I don't have an example of one, but you can kind of see right here. Um, they're disposable. So you use it one time, throw it away. Perfect. You get 32 in this pack. I would definitely repurchase. This is a travel size Listerine Total Care. I'm a Listerine girl. I do try other mouthwashes outside of TheraBreath because it only feels like water to me. But I'm a Listerine girl um, first and foremost. So I will always pur purchase this. This is, I use this for travel. It's good for TSA approved. If you're going on an airplane, blah, 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 would repurchase. This is the Gain um, dish, dish Liquid in the scent Lemon Zest. I love the scent. I don't like the Gain, like this regular dish liquid. You know, I love the spray that I showed you guys. This, 
but I don't necessarily like this. It just does not sud enough for me. It, it doesn't produce enough bubbles and get sudsy enough for me. I, I don't particularly like this in the regular dish liquid. Scent was great. I just don't particularly like it that about it. So I probably would not repurchase just a plain dish liquid like that. I just wouldn't. Um, this is a bar soap, Yardley. I purchased these when I do get them from Dollar Tree. This is the Essential Oil Super Blend. This has orange, lavender, tea tree, and peppermint essential oils. It helps eliminate germs and bacteria. A um, dollar, well, excuse me, dollar twenty-five now. If you see these in Dollar Tree, this is where I purchased them from. I was really nervous about using this or this brand, I should say, because I've seen a lot of people review and say that it doesn't like sud, get sudsy, bubbly enough. And, you know, it doesn't really create a lather for them. But this one, I don't know if the scents make a difference or not, but I will say this one created a wonderful lather for me in the shower and I enjoyed it and the scent was good. So I honestly probably would repurchase it. I don't want to spill anything. This is um, a skinny syrup in the flavor caramel. This is good. I always purchase these from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. It just so happens this one came from TJ Maxx. They are usually $3.99. I try to switch up my flavors as much as I can. Um, but sometimes I just stick to what I know. Vanilla, vanilla cream um caramel or something like that here is a three wick candle this is the mahogany teak wood intense i mean if you like mahogany teak wood you love mahogany teak wood and you know what time it is i mean i would repurchase i love manly scents for the most part i mean bath and body works doesn't really have too many men scents that i don't like in candle form i guess you just you could say so mahogany teak wood is a is a fave of mine um i would always repurchase this is the box i think i think i still have this in my bathroom right now but it's on its way out it's like literally almost done but i put the box in here this is the limited edition for breeze plug and this is in cozy campfire honestly y'all i can't smell nothing but I like the scent. I just feel like it's kind of light for my liking. Like sometimes I can smell that scent and sometimes I can't. And it's it just seems super light, but the scent is nice. I don't know that I would repurchase that particular scent again. This is a small spaces. I don't know where my box is. It's probably in my bucket somewhere, but this was good. I love these for like closets underneath your cabinets, just any small areas that you need to refresh or get a little nice scent in. These are perfect. I will always repurchase. I want to say this was for Breeze Fresh. I don't know. Don't quote me, but it was good, whatever it was. All right, let's see. This was a Listerine Cool Mint. This is not the big bottle. I think when I was looking for Listerine at this particular time when this was purchased, they didn't have the big bottles that I was looking for. So I just was like, okay, I need some mouthwash. I'm just going to get this size. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Hey, it's, it's mouthwash. The size really doesn't matter. Would I repurchase? Absolutely. It's Listerine. Fresh Sparkling Snow. This is a hand soap. From Bath and Body Works. I don't remember. It was okay. Yeah, it was okay. I didn't have it. Icy Melon, Holiday Pear, and Falling Snow are the scent notes. It wasn't bad. I would repurchase. Thanksgiving. I remember using this in November. Did I do an empties in November? Lord, let me stop telling on myself. But anyway, this is Thanksgiving, which is Harvest Gathering. Fresh picked apples, autumn berries, and clove buds. This wasn't bad. And you know what? I surprised myself because I am not a fan of scents with clove in them. Don't ask me why. I don't know. 
I'm just, they turned me off and I'm not into them, but this was not a bad scent. I actually liked it and I shocked myself. Seriously. I love this soap bar. This is the Good Molecules Clarify and Cleanse Bar. I use this as a face wash. I use it as a, bar, a soap bar to cleanse my face and I love it. This is probably like my gazillion, gazillionth one. I've been purchasing these for a long time. I love the way they make my face feel. Um, really good. This is a lighter. And I put this in here, multi-purpose lighter. I put this in here to tell you guys that I purchased like a multi-pack from Sam's Club. This is just one of them. I think the pack came with like maybe four or five lighters in it. And I'm telling you, if you can buy in bulk for something that you use all the time, I would suggest doing it. It comes in handy. It's so much more convenient. I know I've had the electric lighters before. I need to purchase another one. But these, I mean, convenient, quick, something to just grab to light your candles or whatever when you need to. But it was a super great deal. I don't remember. This was a while ago and I still have some left, but I want to say it was like four or five in a pack. And I mean, they last for quite a while. So I got it from Sam's and I would repurchase. This is, I had this in another empties video, but these were the Puffs Plus Lotion with Vicks Vapor Rub. Um, I, this was my second box. And so we finished these, my son and I, I love these. I told you I use Vicks. I've always used Vicks, even when we were growing up. But these are really good. I found these at Walgreens if you're looking for them or you're interested in trying. I would definitely try them out, but they're really good. I would repurchase. This is another three wick candle and this is Bright Christmas Morning. I mean, it was good for what it was. Nothing to write home to grandma about. Ripe red berries, blood orange, crisp apple, and natural essential oils. I want to say, is it? Yeah. So, I mean, it's good. It's, it is what it is. I mean, if you like it in the uh, body care, then I'm sure you would enjoy it in the candle. This is a shower gel I finished. I'm going to tell you guys, I only like marshmallow pumpkin latte in this packaging in the shower gel. Any other any other body care, I did not like it. I did not like the lotion, the body cream, the mist, or anything. And the one from this year, this past season or whatever, it was way too musky for me. This shower gel was the only thing I could tolerate in this packaging. And so I finished it. Would I repurchase? Probably not because I'm not the biggest fan of marshmallow pumpkin latte at all. But I had that shower gel and I just finished it up. It didn't bother me. It was a shower gel. I don't know. This is an air wig. I don't remember what scent it is. I probably... Wait, did I already have... I don't remember, y'all. I'm sorry. But <laughs> it's an air wig and it's done. I don't remember what scent it is. I can't tell. Febreze plug, done. Trying to think what this scent was, but I don't remember. My apologies. This is the Equate brand cotton balls. Uh, jumbo cotton balls. This was 100. Finish this bag. I mean, cotton balls are cotton balls. I really don't have too much of an issue with the brand when it comes to those. So, yeah. I think I have two of these. You know, we're gonna use wipes over here. These are the fragrance free ones. These are the Equate brand. I think I might have another pack, but always for the bathroom. This is a CeraVe hydrating toner. As you can see, it was new. Um, Y'all, this didn't do anything for me. I don't particularly have super dry skin. I have more of combo, oily, or something like that. And I don't know, what this just felt like water. I would not repurchase. Obviously, I am a big fan and I will always stand by the CeraVe brand, period. 
but this particular toner, I don't know. I guess I just wanted to try it out, but it does say for normal to dry skin. So I should have just left it in the store. But anyway, I wanted to try. I did. I didn't particularly like it for me. It just didn't do anything. But y'all are welcome to try it out. This is, you know, the thing y'all keep hearing, my sprayer, glaze spray in the background. So this was a, um, a uh, spray that I emptied. This is the Velvety Berry Bliss. I remember this being really sweet and really good. I enjoyed it. We repurchased that scent. Here is a big tub of the Clorox disinfectant wipes taking up my bucket. A lot of space, but yes, this is this. You guys know I will always repurchase when I need more, but I was stocked up from the C-word season. And so I have plenty right now. I don't know where the top is. I'm probably keeping it to repurpose. But this is BU, Bubbly Rosé. This was good. I mean, it wasn't all that. It's pink sparkling rosé, sweet blood orange, splash of cranberry juice, and natural essential oils. Um, It was okay. Would I repurchase? Maybe not. It just wasn't all that for me. This is a box that I finished. These were the Summer's Eve. And before y'all start going in about Summer's Eve, they are fragrance-free cleansing cloths. They're five-in-one for sensitive skin, fragrance-free because that's all I use down there. Fragrance-free removes odor-causing bacteria, pH balance, free from dyes and parabens, gently cleanses and freshens. These were 16 individually wrapped. I put them in my purse, um, if I was traveling, in my bag, something like that. I think I was watching Chloe Yasmin, if I'm not mistaken, and she had brought these up and mentioned them. And so I wanted to just try them out. So I got this small box, and this was super cheap, honestly. Um, it was only 16 in the box, but I want to say it was under $3. I would definitely um, repurchase again. This is the Simple brand. This is a soothing facial toner, 100% alcohol free. You know, this brand does not have fragrance or anything like that. There is no harsh chemicals, artificial perfumes, or dyes that can upset your skin. This is a pretty good brand. I mean, this toner really didn't do a whole lot for me, but it was okay. I think I purchased that brand out of TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I don't remember, but what I repurchased, probably not because it just really doesn't do it a whole lot for my skin, but it is gentle and effective and no fragrance if you're looking for something like that in a toner for your skin. This is another candle, Tis the Season. I don't know how I felt about this. It is rich red apple, sweet cinnamon, and cedar wood. I mean, I guess it was okay. It wasn't all that. What I repurchased, probably not. If it, from here on out, if it doesn't wow me or I don't love it or something like that, I probably won't repurchase. I don't know. It's just, I'm over some of this stuff. <laughs> here is some wax melts. This is Sensational's uh, Rock Candy. This was pretty good. Um... Semi-light on the light side, but sweet, good. Um, I probably would repurchase. I mean, you can com you can always combine some of the wax melts with another scent to make it stronger and make it pop out more. Or you can just put like three or four of them in there and it will give like a stronger scent. So, I mean, I could work with it. Obviously, this is not the top to this candle, but this is a pink Prosecco frosting this was good i'm probably keeping the top or something so that's why i don't know what happened I obviously didn't that didn't do too well but i think this was like my second or third one in this scent if i'm not mistaken so i don't think it's around anymore but would i repurchase probably um sensitive skin bar i told you i i, I run through these I've run through sensitive skin. I put this in the bag because I felt like it would leak and I didn't want it to get all over the place. But this is a repeat purchase for me. This is the Miel 
uh, oil. It's a strengthening oil. Rosemary, mint, scalp and hair, strengthening oil. This is infused with biotin and encourages growth. Um, then, like I said, this is a repeat purchase. I have purchased several of these. I love this for my hair. I know a lot of the girls use this and they are familiar with it. Um, but what I will say that I don't like with some of these bottles with the droppers is that once it gets down to the very bottom, it's hard to pick anything up with this. I honestly prefer, if I had an example, I would show you guys, but I honestly prefer the bottles like this that have the twist top and then you can just do that and rub it in your scalp or whatever if you wanted to. I don't necessarily like these for hair oils, seriously, I, or for any type of oil, serums or anything for your skin, but I love the product. I'm not going to knock the product, but I don't necessarily like the bottle when it starts to get down to the bottle. Let me get the last little bit out of here, and then I have a few more. This is gum. <laughs> y'all like, why she got gum in here? But this was good, y'all. I got this from Dollar Tree. This is a Trident Splash Strawberry with Lime. It only, it's only 15 pieces, but I just had it in my purse. It's really good. I enjoyed it. And you get it from Dollar Tree. This is a hand cream. And this is the Rainbow Candy Swirl. A lot of people was knocking this scent. I don't have it in the mini body care that it came in, but I did like it in the hand cream. Um, I enjoyed it. I would purchase the hand cream again. Um, Vanilla Bean Noel Pocket Bag. I don't know if y'all can see that, but... It is Vanilla Bean Noel. This was okay. Not bad at all. Do I necessarily love the body care? No, I think I still have a body scrub, but it's okay. It's not horrible, but would I go get a whole collection of Vanilla Bean Noel? Probably not. This is the OG Strawberry Pound Cake in a pocket bag. Of course, I loved it. This was a cortisone cream. I remember having this for a while. This is good. This is the one with aloe. Yes. I mean, you can use it on pretty much anything. If you have a rash, an itch. Um, I know I use this a lot when I go home to visit and the mosquitoes are like super bad during the summertime and they are like fresh meat. Let's go. And they tear my legs and arms and stuff up. This is super good. This is really the only thing that really helps me when I have mosquito bites during the summer too. Um, lavender and vanilla pocket bag. Of course, that's my number one top fave um, aromatherapy scent. This is, this big jug is the Para, what is it? Persil Pro Clean um, laundry detergent. This was in the deep clean as you can see and it gets visible and invisible dirt y'all i didn't really like this i mean i saw people talking about it on social media and stuff like that i don't know for one i guess it has a clean scent to it but it's so light and i just it don't lather i can see like in the washer like it just doesn't sud or lather super well i, I don't know i just i just didn't really care for it I don't know what else to say. I would not repurchase that particular one. This is the Dove Winter Care Limited Edition. I have this in the body wash and I also have the soap bars. Um, so I have been using one during some of these colder months. This is really good. I can't really describe the scent or tell you that it has one, but this is um, good for restores and nourishes dry winter skin. Good, I would repurchase. Um, I have not used these products, but after Christmas, during the Christmas sale, when I told you guys on my Instagram, make sure you're following me over there if you're not already, um, about the gift sets that went on clearance at Target. And so this was one of them. I just wanted to show you guys the box. This is the one that I picked up. This is the Wakanda Forever. My Black is Beautiful. And this has the shampoo and the conditioner. So when I purchased this, 
um that that particular day that i went in there it was only 50 percent off i saw on instagram the very next day the gift sets and christmas items had went down to um had went 75 percent off and so when i put on my stories that i went back and got the price adjustment that's what i was referring to <laughs> so in all in all with 75% off that with the shampoo and conditioner that set only ended up being like five to six bucks. Great deal. Wonderful deal. Um, this is from Christmas time. These are the K cups, um, the great value Walmart brand advent calendar. Um, it had 24 unique flavors y'all. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and name every single flavor but they had them listed on the side of the box i enjoyed this um when we traveled to atlanta to my brothers to be with him and my nephew i took it with me um for christmas when we traveled i took it with me there so one of my um one of the girlies on instagram um if I can think of it, I will, if I remember, I will put her name up here, her Instagram. Her sister had got this for her and she posted it on her Instagram page or her story. And I was like, oh my gosh, I really want to try. Um, sometimes I get caught up in sticking with what I know and getting the same flavors when it comes to K-Cups um for my Keurig machine and so I was interested in trying that so I could kind of try out some different flavors like let me switch it up and that was really nice to tell I don't remember all of the flavors that I didn't enjoy but there were a few that I really liked and then others were just like eh or I just didn't like them at all but overall it was good for what it was I think it was like 10 bucks when I purchased it from Walmart but it was really nice um that was the first time I had seen something like that when she posted it and so i was dying to try it out so i did um let's see what's down here so yep as i thought this is another wipe for the bathroom fragrance free this is the equate brand from walmart i put this in here to show you guys this is just one is it upside down this is just one out of the enormous package but i purchased when i um, when I think of it, I go to Sam's, as you can see, Members Mark, that's the Sam's Club brand. But I get tissue and um, toilet tissue for the bathroom and paper towels from Sam's Club when I can. Um, this is just one package. When I tell you the packages of the toilet tissue and the paper towels last me for months, it's worth it, guys. If you shop at BJ's, Costco, or Sam's Club, go get your toilet paper. Now, obviously I don't know the quality of their products at BJ's and Costco, but I'm telling you this toilet paper from Sam's is, is just as good, if not better than Charmin or any other toilet paper that you use. And it will last you for months. Try it out. If you're a member at Sam's and you're not buying your toilet paper and paper towels from there, I'm telling you, you're missing out. Here's a poof. I use the um, African sponges and I also use these. You don't come for me. I know what they say. They carry bacteria and all that. But listen, I love a good um, sponge, poof, whatever you want to call it. And so I'm going to continue to use both and I'm going to just dispose of it when it needs to be disposed of. That one actually was from Bath and Body Works, I think. This is a Lysol spray. I know this thing is dirty, y'all, so I'm going to go ahead and take it down. But this is an all-purpose cleaner and the lemon scent. I love lemon scents for the kitchen. Mm, I don't know why. I just do. I love lemon scents for the kitchen. This was really good. Um, Would repurchase. Y'all got stuff everywhere. Here's another hand soap. If anyone can tell me, this is a men's scent from Bath & Body Works. I'm telling you, it is. This is a straight up men's scent. Which one? I don't know. I'm, if anyone knows in the comments, please let me know. But this is Sparkling Icicles. Um, and the scent notes are Sparkling Citrus, Golden Sandalwood, and Bergamot. If anyone knows by those scent notes, Sparkling Citrus, 
golden sandalwood and bergamot which men sent from bath and body works this is please let me know in the comments because i don't feel like looking it up right now but all they did was put a, one of the men scents in this hand soap and they slapped the sparkling icicles package on it for christmas that's it i'm telling you this smells straight up like a dude it smelled good and i would repurchase Ooh, y'all i got stuff everywhere this is another laundry product. I think I got this, as you can tell, from Big Lots. And this is the OxyClean Max 4 Spray Laundry Stain Remover. This is really good, y'all. I think I like this better than I like Shout. I saw this in Big Lots, and it was my first time seeing it, and I wanted to try it out. And I really did enjoy this. I would definitely repurchase. I, I, honestly, I do plan to repurchase, but it was really good. Y'all, I'm really trying to move along. Okay, this is another empty from my son. Of course, you know, as I am brand. And this is, this is one of the products I want to try. But this is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Water. It has Jamaican Black Castor Oil, Vitamin C, and Vitamin E. And so instead of spraying just regular water on your hair for all my natural ladies or whoever, you know, um, you can use this instead. And it actually has the Jamaican Black Castor Oil already in it. I've heard great reviews on this. Obviously, my son loves it too, because here it is. And so, is this gonna be in the way? Yes. So, I want to try that out. Okay. Mm. Here is another laundry product. This is Shout. This is the, um, I think, dye and fragrance free. Yes, and this is gentle on baby clothes. Um, Yes. So this is the laundry stain remover shout. This was okay. I mean, I like that it's free of fragrance and dye. So if you want to, you know, use this on your clothes or something that you don't necessarily want the fragrance and everything, then this is something gentle um, you can use. This wasn't bad. Don't get me wrong. Um, so I probably would repurchase this. I do like shout. I just really like the OxyClean too once I tried it out. Um, this is another hand soap, vanilla snowflake, joy to the world. Yeah. This was good. I enjoyed this. I'm spilling drops, but it is empty, y'all. Um, creamy vanilla, toasted coconut and sparkling citrus. This was good. I would repurchase. I do not want my empties to be this long. Like, I have way too much stuff that I accumulate. These were the Airwick plugins, and this was a limited edition scent for the fall, I believe. Apple Cinnamon Medley. Obviously, they're gone. So, but I enjoy the scent. I remember that there were two. And so I think I've used them both. Um, excuse me, y'all. <laughs> This is the Febreze Wax Melts. I remember purchasing these when I did some time ago from Big Lots. They were good. Um, obviously, they're kind of old. So what? the only thing I didn't like is that this kind of residue kind of sticks in the packaging a little bit. Very great scent. I'm pretty sure we will never be able to find these again. If you do, let me know down in the comments where I can get them. But I do enjoy them. And they're a little bit bigger than the typical size wax melt. So... Super good, very nice scent. If y'all do find them, let me know. I think I got my last two items if I can get it. Oh, child. Okay, these are toothbrush covers. The Equate brand comes in a four pack, fits most toothbrushes. Um, I have an electric toothbrush. I think it's a Philips Sonicare 2. But I also use regular toothbrushes. I mean, I'm not biased. I will use either or. It was four of them. So if you do use regular toothbrushes as well, you can get these and they are good for keeping your, you know, your brush head clean and this dust and germs and stuff off of them. And I purchased these from Walmart. They were super cheap. I don't remember exactly um, how much, but they weren't much at all. And the last item, yes, thank you, God. These are, I think I hauled these in a, in a video from my Ulta haul. 
These are the do it, do it all, if I can talk, wipes from the Love Wellness brand. It had 15 in them. They are pH balanced, natural wipes for intimate cleansing. I really like these, you guys. I would definitely repurchase. Um, Ulta, if I'm not mistaken, I got these from Ulta. I mean, it's, it's kind of like a trial, not trial. It's kind of like a travel size. I mean, there's only 15, but I what I liked about them was that they were not too thin. They didn't break easily. They were moist, but not too moist. You know, sometimes with wipes, it's like they can be too dry or they can be too wet. You know, I don't want them drenched in moisture that you have to wring it out you know like squeeze it <laughs> you know i don't want it dripping wet but they were very moist i mean they were really good i would repurchase that is it that's a lot i know but i wanted to get this stuff out of the way um again i'm back you guys can expect some more videos from me coming soon um Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Happy New Year again. If I didn't say it already, I can't remember. But thank you guys to everyone who have um, subscribed to my channel so far. I appreciate each and every one of you. I am praying and I am hoping that 2023 is a blessed and prosperous year for all of us. Not just on YouTube, but just in life, period. And I'm going to leave it at that. Thank you guys for watching. If you have not subscribed already, please do so. Like, comment, and share this video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.